with some tricks for a rookie. Oh, what is keeping Leo up? He is getting tattooed here, and he has to go, and it's over. That's what the boss is about. He's destroyed a very brave opponent, and he hasn't broken a sweat. And he's looking around as if to say, is that what the pro game is about? Isn't that easy? Well, no, it isn't. Switching with a body shot there. Joshua leading off with a left hand to the body. Oh, nailed him. That right hand. I think one more punch will get him out of there. And I think Howard Foster's getting ready to step in here because nobody wants to see Butlin get hurt. Body shots coming in. He's all over the place here. And that's it. The towel comes in. Howard Foster says that's enough. And a smile at the end from Paul Butlin who says, yeah, I've been in with something special there. Well, it was a two-punch combination, but it was the right hand just exploded on the eyebrow of Paul Butlin. I think he realises uh, the man in front of him poses no threat. So I think he's just enjoying himself a little while here. Made yeah, a little step back for no reason. Yep, he's in no hurry. Oh, that might be the end of that. A really sharp kiss check. Just lunges in. You've got to credit his bravery, but he's getting a pounding in there, and that's that. No, it's been stopped. All over. Kiszczek wanted to go on. But all the damage was done by that brutal combination that put the Croatian on the floor. He's still complaining. He still wants to go on, but I think he's been spared, because he was going to get hurt if he'd carry on. He's got a big heart, this fella, but that's all he had. He's just so heavy-handed, Joshua. He doesn't oh, have to a terrific right hand. right hand. Again, Darts did well to take that. Darts is struggling. He's in trouble. And there is an argument that's to enough. say that's enough, and it is. Because Darts wasn't going to go easy. But he was hurting, and he was hurting badly. And another clinical, brutal performance from Anthony Joshua. And Joshua senses it and goes to work. Picking some wicked body shots, and eventually Avila has to just hang on. But he's shaken up already. He looked at his corner there as if to say, what have you done to me? And he's gone. And I don't think he wants any part of this. He's holding his ear as if the ear's gone, but now, no. He's moved it away and he's not getting up. He had no interest. No, but we've seen him box before, but I've never seen him put so much thought into it. He's giving this a go. He's glad to be here. Getting the high guard up there as Joshua Dark. Oh, 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 that right hand uppercut. Bang. Three, four, Doesn't matter how much of a go you have. If you get tagged like that, you're in desperate trouble. And he's done. One big right hand. Good night. Skelton's Joshua looked to land the right hand, but he's taking his time and measuring it up, and that right hand did the damage. He just waited to pull the trigger on that right hand. Is it going to be another inside two rounds for Joshua? Takes his time, measures him up again. Skelton's all over the place. Steve Gray says that's it. Matt Skelton sinks to his haunches. He was destroyed by that right hand. He's done it again. Seven out of seven inside two rounds. Joshua miss another smile from the Watford man. Oh, oh that's yeah. the one. Didn't miss that time. Took everything, didn't he? One big right hand and a punch as he was on the floor. Now there's a difference in Irish's body language now. He's felt the full power, and that was bang on the chin. He did well to take that. He still be in there. Full credit to him. And it gets another one. That's how it's coming. And he got absolutely slaughtered with a left hand right on the uh, Right on the decision of Steve Gray to jump in there. They've seen enough in the corner. They said, I'm getting the towel in. And Steve Gray, I think, had seen enough as well. It was that first knockdown, that big right hand that did all the damage. And Ian John Lewis might have a job to do because Backtop is so brave, he's standing up to this, but he is getting pounded. And Ian John Lewis did absolutely the right thing because Backtop, oh, he's letting it go on. Well, I thought he was stopping it. He should be and he will, <laughs> and he has. If you hadn't seen him before and you wondered what the fuss was about, that is what the fuss is about. Sprock, as you say, Jim. 
past his best now, right hand comes through and he's wobbled, he's shaken by that and Joshua straight on him and sprouts in big trouble here. Joshua just teeing off Is that and Terry O'Connor says that will do it right there. I've been sick. Stunning. That should have been a bit earlier because Sprott was in big trouble. Goodness me. And the referee, was he watching the fight? A referee, it? Goodness me, he should have stepped in a lot sooner than that. I mean, that shows you the power this man has, that the, the punch that caused the, the, the damage was, all, was partially blocked, but it still had the power. Even when he's completely in top, you know, he keeps his shape, he keeps his hands up, gets his punches out, brings them back. And here we come now. Gavin in trouble down. Probably envisages doing this job a lot more cleanly than he's been able to do, but you can't fault him. He's facing a very experienced campaigner. And down he goes Four. again, left hand again. Two. And Victor Lachlan's got to put an end to this. Four. Because Five. Gavin is a brave, brave Six. man, but I don't think, yeah, he's going to give it a go again. Eight. But this is, this is getting ugly here, and it's waved off. It's done. Anthony Joshua does it again. This time, he was left-hand happy, and it's destroyed Jason Gavin. But he's already starting to come apart. He did go 12 with Shannon Briggs, but Shannon Briggs a shell of the fighter he once was. And a right hand lays him Two, out. Beautifully three, timed four, by Anthony five, Joshua. Six, and seven, the count's eight, at eight. Nine, this is done and dusted. It is his sixth. how to survive I'm, I'm amazed he's lasted this long the punches he's taken there well that reputation for durability is well well deserved but how much longer can this go on and it's stopped it's over done inside two rounds kingpin just got bowled over and the biggest smile in the place belongs to anthony joshua who does it again what on earth are they going to do with him next some alarm bells through the heavyweight division in world boxing. No one's come close to doing that to Kevin Johnson. I fancy that it happened. Looking for the body of Joshua with a straight right hand. Ah. Joshua looking very sharp. Here it nails him with a right hand inside the first minute. Joshua looking to measure him up. Could this be gone in the first? He's caught him with another right hand. And Cornish is in desperate trouble already. Now, the technique that Joshua is showing at the moment is terrific. You wouldn't believe only a dozen fights. And it's all over. It's all over in 90 seconds. Anthony Joshua's biggest test on paper has turned into his quickest win. Joshua not letting him off the hook. Howard Foster having a close look now. And as long as White returns fire once in a while, which he is doing, Foster but look at the legs. There's a grin from White, but the legs are betraying him, and down he goes. He's hurt. The way surely, he down. surely no way up here for Dylan White. It's stopped. It's over. Dramatic and unbelievable at the finish. Joshua asked a lot of questions tonight, came up with the answer when it mattered, and it was a brutal finish. Come forward a little bit more, trying to lead off with his southpaw right, look for the, the left. Got him, right hand, on the floor, Martin looks into his corner, as if to say, what on earth was that? Joshua's had him on the floor, and there's still a minute 40 left in this second round. And he's down again, and Joshua, on the brink here, strolls into the corner, as if to say, job done, and Martin looks like he's been wrecked. Destroyed. Over. Done. Britain has a new world heavyweight champion. And that's what he gets in return. A three-punch combination upstairs that rocks the head back. And then Joshua goes to work and puts him on the floor. Joshua get the finish here in round seven. Everybody on their feet. Brazil fighting for his life now, but he's down again. And it's all over. Howard Foster's waved it off. He's got nothing left. Anthony Joshua does it again. Still world champion. Well, that, that was everything we wanted tonight. We wanted a few rounds. We wanted to see Joshua having to work against someone who wasn't here to quit. Maybe he feels safer at this rate.
hands for Joshua. Like the Predator, he's going hunting, and he's going hunting now. Oh, the right hand. Great work there from Joshua. That right hand found its way home, and we saw the effects. And Molina does not want to be in here now. The fight's over. Stopped in the third round. Anthony Joshua defending his IBF heavyweight title in emphatic fashion. And just a smile down to you, David, at ringside, as if to say, we may meet. Joshua's trying to finish him, right down, down, goes, click go. Amazing career. Second knockdown is aimed at ending the fight. Body shot, left hook upstairs, right hand, David Fields is going to stop it. Anthony Joshua wins. And that, ladies and gentlemen, I know Joshua came in with a belt, but that is how you become the heavyweight champion. It is Arsenal, so don't be surprised if we see the end. Good uppercut again. The big thick legs of Carlos Taka, but he stays out right for the others. Having a close look now because Taka's not going to win this. Anthony Joshua now retains his world heavyweight titles. It is Scott Carlos Taka complains. He bitterly protests. He has been outstanding as a challenger on such short notice.